Well done indeed. Let's have a look back at some of the uh, highlights from this final round. George Hall just dropped a shot at five after three birdies in a row, but this was a, she's about today and all week bounce back ability. Finding the back flag on six is not an easy job, but Georgia Hall did that. Left herself this six footer. Pushed it in the side door for her fourth birdie of the round. Yeah, she bogeyed that hole the last couple of days, so a little bit of revenge there for her. Dropped a shot at the 10th hole and avoided another one at 11. But even at this point, no one really getting anywhere near her uh, at the summit. They played a beautiful lob shot to here. Missed that one low. Yeah, it was a little wobble here, and, and this is where Napoleova got within four, especially after the tee shot at 16. But she said she didn't hit a bad shot, just didn't ride the wind like she expected. Overdrew one into the 16th, and that water is so close to the green. She managed to escape with a bogey in the end, and it was a good one. And if there were any doubts starting to creep in, well, she got rid of those at the par 4 17th. Yeah, I said she'll want to hold this because she wants to win in style. Walking that one in. Five shot lead on the 18th. Shared the lead at the end of day one and two. Led on her own after day three. And a mile apart at the end of round four. Very different scoring to what we saw in November. 23 under Lydia Co won it with Georgia Hall with, with minus 11, but conditions have been very different. 